Okay, so we just have like the porpoise, the pinbo, the right whale, and the sperm whale are more closely related now. And then the camel and the rhino are like not related at all to the whales. Okay, and how did you guys get the information to tell you that the camel and rhino were not related? What did you use? We looked at well, the differences on the chart. Yeah. The differences in what? Um, like, just like the differences and like the genes that they have. Okay. Okay. Good. And so you have the porpoise, hippo, right whale, and sperm whale all together more recently. Yeah. All right. Got it. Nice. Group two. We are group two. And this is ours. We have long time. Goes through whole time because that's just really long. And they're all kind of connected the same way. But it's like we have our whale, that's whale, the porpoise, and the hippo right at the end. This is, goes on to more recent. And we have uh, the draft deer and the cow because they're all pretty similar. And the pigs and the pestary, they're all pretty similar also. And then camel and rhino were by themselves. And then there's like, I think it should be right there. Now, why did you guys put the hippo and or hippo and whales and porpoise together? Because they all had like the two or three differences. And okay. All pretty similar to each other. Okay. Very nice. Group three. Okay. Well, we started down here with the beginning of longest time ago and the rhino and the camel were not related to anything pretty much so they're on their own things and then the pig and the peccary are on their own thing because they're kind of really related and as you go up there's the giraffe and the deer and the cow which are more related 